All right, so I'm here with the legendary Shoebox Marty, one of the, the top guns in the city when it comes to the shoe game. Shoebox Marty, this is his top 10 summer shoes. I mean, he got like 50 summer shoes, but I just told him just pick 10, man. This, my first pair is these right here. Nobody, these, you see how they got them like, I got them looking like dirty. I did this on purpose. I wore this shoe like this on purpose because I needed a, I needed a vintage look to it. Yeah. This is like this remind me of when you watch those old ass basketball movies, the Dr. J's and all that. Right. This remind me of that, and I like that way that they look when they playing with them on dirty and all that. So that's why I keep it like this. I could clean it, but I don't want to. So what are those for people that don't know? These are Converse Pro Leather, man. These is these is. Got it on your heritage, man. It's like one of the first basketball shoes. Nice. Yeah. So I keep mine looking like this. I don't want to feel like Brooklyn, New York or something. Mm -hmm. so yeah. My second one. Summertime joints. You gotta have some summer. You gotta have some. Even though like um, like, people do what they do. Celebrate how they celebrate. But these, the, the Independence Day Blazers. See that one shot. Oh, so it's red on one side, blue on the other. Okay. Yeah. Right there. That's crazy. Them my joints right there. Them. We can, do, we can wear them to every barbecue in the summer. These right here. These is fun. These I like that this Jordan because the suede. This was fun shootout. This definitely give you summertime vibes. Like you know what I'm saying. You can do your thing in these whenever you want. You can. And what are those called for the people? These is the Jordan Fearless Collection. These the, the blues. Oh wow. Yeah, these the blues. That's the designer. You see, he got his little logo right there. These was dope. I almost cried when I didn't get these. Shout out to Stock X. They did they shit on that. I like those. What's these? Shoe number four. What's these? You said. Ooh. Ooh. A lot. This. This shoe right here. This Nathan Bill. This. This. This summertime for real. This is a nice running shoe. Summertime, you can use. Look at that shoe. Look at that. Wow. I never, I never even wore this shoe yet. I don't think I'm probably never gonna wear it. What did it say on there, guys? They say I can't feel my legs. The last ones are get to riding the egg, you know, try and stop me. So what are those shoes like dedicated to or like what is that? It's the Nathan Bell joint. It's like a, like a breast cancer awareness shoe. Oh, okay. Cancer awareness shoe. Yeah, I seen those online, man. I seen when you posted a picture online of those, and I was looking at it. Yeah, it went crazy. Like, I even had to give it a like. But I'm not even a big fan of pink, but I had to give those a like just because of the whole concept. The pink. This why it's pink. That's right, pink right. This why this one yellow. You this, feel me? And actually, though, like I was telling you earlier, I got, I, this is two different pairs of shoes. So oh, word. I, so I bought two pairs of shoes, and I just mismatched them myself. So wait, so they had the yellows and they had the pinks. You bought both pairs? Yeah, I bought both pairs. Wow. Just, just cause, man, who don't know about story about me, Patrick. And they best friends, so you gotta rock them together. Yeah. So what you do with the other two shoes, though? They just down there waiting to get, for me to fuck these ones up so I can wear them. Wow. <laughs> Hey, that's so, smart though. That's smart. It's all they doing. Sitting there. Look, I even look, I have to go get like, socks with these. I love these kind of these. And I ain't really a fan of these. These run kind of small. I ain't really a fan of these, but I had to. I had to do these. That's dope. Especially two pounds. My wife almost killed me for that. Before we give them shoe number six, man, why don't you tell us a little bit, like how how did you get into the whole shoe game? Them shoes that you couldn't get when you were seven and eighteen and all that. And mom like, I ain't spending my money on that. They just remaking them again. You can go get them again. I remember I couldn't get those. Cool niggas in the school had them on. I couldn't have them on. Right. Now I got them. But my summertime, shoe number six. I'm going to bring out. I like to. We're going to have fun with this one. This one. Yeah, this thing. Third on it. I like that. These right so there. people actually like their shoes to be dirty? No. Nah, no. Nah. People don't like that. I just. Some real, shoes real like shoe. this. They give you like a, a, a like my classes? Nah, no dirt on those. 
Ah, so certain ones. Yeah, some like this. This is fun. This was a little cheap shoe. This was fun. Why not get this dirty? You get like the kid shoes or have fun like the kid in it. This is good. See that with the Tweety and Sylvester on that side? Uh, first joint. That's what's up. Like, I ain't, I ain't gonna, I probably never will. At least I probably never will. Keep the third on there, probably never will ever do it. You know, this is a classic pair because everybody, we call it the Ford Gumps. This is what we call it, the Ford Gumps. You see a nigga in the hood with these on, you're like, yeah, he got the Ford Gumps on. <laughs> these ain't expensive, nothing. You get this everywhere. This ain't even exclusive. But, if you like shit, it's a classic you go, shoe. You're gonna go get you a Forrest Gump. I don't care who you is. So we talking about Forrest Gump, like from the movie Ooh, Forrest, Forrest Gump. Gump. You had these for her, Jenny. These was what he was Oh, uh, okay. He's cool. Tell you, this, this is classic for me. I ain't, I ain't gonna never. I, I, I literally got three pair of these. Now um, we get into the nitty gritty. Let me, sh let me show y'all something about this shit. He's showing the retro game now. Yeah, these. Them is this hard. This ain't. This is summer night shoe. This ain't really summer day shoe. Got this you. is summer night shoe. That's you summer you going to the club. I actually, I got a picture on uh, Facebook. I think I took a Facebook. I wore this shoe like this. I wore one like this, one like this. When I had the boot. I just fell off now, so that's why I probably will never wear it again. Just get it. But I wore this with the shoe string hanging on the side like this. Just showing the naturalness. Yeah, like. With this shoe. And you know what's crazy? Because a lot of people think like, oh, he got the shoes, or call him, he got the shoes. I usually do, but I had to actually pay extra for these. Like I was, I was actually a consumer of retail. I don't usually happen to me. <laughs> but yeah, I went and bought those. These two. These two. I didn't like these at first. So this is shoe number nine. Yeah, this shoe number nine. I didn't like these at first though. So I'm gonna just, you know, say my little piece about them. I, I really don't like 14s. Me neither. They ugly. They but me a Batman or some shit. You feel me? The, the triangle look. But those, I'm not gonna cap. Those is cold. Them is the coldest 14s I've ever seen. Just, I had got these. I got these a week early. I, I knew, I knew it was gonna be a line down the fucking thing. When you see shit getting posted on Facebook and reshared and reshared like that, you know, like, oh, you ain't gonna be able to get that shit unless you do something crazy. So I spent a little extra for mine to get them early, but I still was in the line waiting with the people because I needed some more pairs. I, I That's what's up. Some money on these. So, so basically mine was free. Last but not least. He wanted me to do these. So this might be one of my favorite summertime shoes that you got. <laughs> I just feel like, you know, that one, you don't want to even want to pull those out no other no other time but the summer. Those look so nice. I like these. I actually bought these to resale. I was in the mall. Didn't even know no drawer was coming out. I was just in the mall early. I was just like a walk trying to get rid of this bag. Some lines. I got like five pairs of these I saw. Not With the, some Nick Cannon wilding out shit. That's what I thought. That's the first thing went through my mind. Like, this is what they be doing with Nick Cannon. That's what you wear when you got your grill in your mouth, when you got the iced out yeah, grill in your yeah, mouth. Yeah. That's just, you know, the bust down roll you with it or something crazy. People so out of all out of all ten of those, what's your favorite? What's your favorite shoe? My favorite? Out of all ten of these? All gotta ten. be the, these. Like I can't I ain't never look. Yeah. You so definitely killed it. Kyrie in there for this, man. This was crazy. They killed it. This was crazy, right? And I, you know what? And you know what I'm upset about though? About it all. I spent too much money on two pair of shoes. I wish they would have came like that. Kyrie, you listening? Make sure you make another pair. Yeah, make sure you make sure you match. If you gonna make a Batman, don't go make a Robin, make a fat man and a Robin, put them together. You feel yeah. me? See, so you already got that. So if he make that idea, he gotta come pay shoe box Marty, man. Something. Somebody owe me something. I don't really get a lot. I gotta, I gotta work for this shit. So somebody owe me something.